One of the interactive features inside of Camtasia is the ability to create a table of contents. The easiest way to do this is to create a table of contents from markers that you've placed on your timeline. It's easy to do. Simply come down to the left and turn on the Markers tab right along the timeline. Then, to add a marker, simply click on the blue plus button along the timeline where you'd like to add your marker. The markers come in with a generic name, but they can easily be customized up here in the Properties drawer. When you're ready to produce your video, you can share it to Screencast.com or your TechSmith Relay instance, and these table of contents will be created automatically. You can also produce it as a local file using the Smart Player option with Inside Camtasia. If you want more control over how your table of contents look, you can use the settings in Custom Production Settings to show when the table of content shows up, where, and its appearance. When the published video is viewed here on a website, in the bottom right hand corner you'll have the control over turning on and off your table of contents. You can then skip around to view different sections that you want, or you can use the search bar at the top to search for a specific term listed in your marker.